Hey Patriots, welcome back to Let's Talk. I'm Jason Peña, and here again we're going to be showcasing another one of our new teachers. Today we have our theater elective teacher, Ms. Good. Hi, how are you? I'm great, how are you? I'm good. So how has teaching theater been so far? Uh, so far it's been really amazing. Uh, I love working with uh, the kids at this school. I love working with my coworkers. It's been a great school year so far. Everyone's been really nice. I'm glad you're enjoying it. How long have you been teaching theater? Um, well, I've been teaching in general for about five years. I started um, as an ESC teacher in 2020. Um, and then because I went to college for theater and I have my bachelor's in theater performance, uh, when, a, uh, when a position for a theater teacher opened up, I was able to take that. So I've been teaching for about five years, but I've been teaching theater specifically for about for three years now. That's amazing. What do you like about teaching theater? Um, well, I have always loved performing and dancing and singing, and that's always been a passion of mine. So I love being able to open up that passion in uh, children, especially kids who may be a little shy and don't really know their footing yet. So I just love being able to open up that That's part. so inspiring. What inspired you to start teaching theater? Um, well, like I said, when I was younger, I always loved performing, and actually, I always wanted to be a singer, uh, but I was always terrified to sing, so uh, when I was in middle school, actually, um, I had saw High School Musical 3, and I was like, oh, well, if I can't do singing, I can do musical theater because that's just singing with acting, and um, I started taking acting classes to make me comfortable uh, acting on stage and then that passion turned from me being just a drama kid to going to college and doing it and I've just always loved performing ever since I was a little kid. That's amazing. Have you done any shows in the past? I have. Uh, so when I was in college I did a few shows in college. I did a uh, Cat on a Hot Tin Roof, I did Jesus Christ Superstar, um, and then when I graduated college I worked for the Orlando Theater Rep, as well as the Lakeland Community Theater, um, where I did uh, Annie Get Your Gun, Sister Act shows like that. And I was able, I got the opportunity to do uh, Off-Broadway. There's this musical called Be More Chill, and I did that in 2020, 2021, something like that. Uh, so that's always, you know, yeah. <laughs> that's amazing. Do you have any other hobbies you do on your free time? Um, I love music. I play guitar, bass, trumpet, a little bit of piano, and I love reading. I'm a big reader. How do you help your students embrace their talents? Um, I'm a big believer in, obviously, encouragement, um, but also I genuinely believe that any kid can do anything they put their mind to. So if somebody tells me that they want to do something but maybe they're a little nervous, I try to remind them that, hey, everybody gets nervous. You know, Beyonce gets nervous, Taylor Swift gets nervous, everybody gets nervous, but they are some of the biggest names in the world. So I always try to remember, like, try to remind them that that's just called being human. It's great how you help students embrace their talents. Thank you. Lightning round questions. LA or New York? New York. <laughs> robots or drones? Uh, robots. <laughs> Jump rope or hula hoop? Jump rope. <laughs> <laughs> Watching plays or doing them? Um, ooh, doing a play. <laughs> well, Patriots, that's it for Let's Talk. If you see Miss Good in the hallway, make sure to say hi. Until next time.